Hello YouTube, welcome back to another UK Wanderlust video. In this video, we'll be showcasing some of the best markets to explore in London. If you're shopping for fresh groceries or just looking for something fun to do on the weekend, you're in luck. These historical markets are our top 5 picks for best markets in London. In this video, we'll be showcasing Borough Market, Camden Market, King's Cross Canopy Market, Brixton Market, and Spitalfields Market. As always, if you like this video, It'd be greatly appreciated if you'd like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends. If you missed our previous video about the top 4 tourist locations, don't forget to check it out by clicking the link in the top of the video now. Coming in first on our list is Borough Market. Borough Market is a must-see location for both locals and tourists alike. This historic food market has been at its present site since 1756 and is renowned for selling top quality artisanal food and drinks in the city. Borough Market draws its history back nearly 1,000 years to a time when London was extremely different than it is today. This market originated south of the River Thames on the London Bridge in an area known as Southwark. As the largest and oldest food market in London, you can spend hours looking around at the 100 plus stalls. One of the beauties of this location is the wide array of traders offering unique cultural products from different nationalities that cannot be found in supermarkets. If you're looking for a market to explore in London, Borough Market cannot be missed. Next on our list is the Camden Lock Market. Located in the eccentric district of Camden Town, this market is a truly unique experience. Founded in the early 70s, Camden Market started as a tiny pop-up outside of a newly founded dance hall. The legendary dance hall was named Dingwalls and was converted from an old packaging warehouse. This market is located alongside the Regent's Canal and is situated near the canal locks that were essential for modifying water levels for passing boats. Throughout the years, Camden Town has been a hub for the art, music, and fashion scene. With many celebrities performing here, including The Clash, Sex Pistols, and The Ramones. Additionally, Amy Winehouse operated a stall in the Camden Lock Market as a teenager, and Prince also operated a shop for fans as well. Almost anything you can think of can be found at Camden Lock Market, including jewelry, clothing, tapestries, food, drinks, and much, much more. Besides the market, Camden Town is an essential tourist location. Camden Town is the perfect place to experience where tons of London style has originated throughout the years. Also, you can enjoy a lovely walk along the canal to link up with another market on our list, the King's Cross Canopy Market. After a short walk down the canal, here we are at number 3, the King's Cross Canopy Market. Built in 1888, the Canopy is a historic glass-covered market hall. This was once a food hub where produce was brought into London to be distributed throughout the capital. Today, the Canopy Market is a revival of the historic marketplace, bringing together amazing food, crafts, and designers all in one place. If you're looking for some unique food or beverages, this is definitely the place to be. There are many vendors specializing in different cultural foods and craft brews. Some examples are Mexican food, Asian, Turkish, and Indian food. Also, many vendors offer crafted items such as jewelry, clothes, and art. Once you've gotten your food or pints at the market, be sure to walk down to the canal and sit on the steps. 
During the summer months, the steps are covered in turf, so you can really relax and enjoy the occasional sunny day. Overall, you will not regret visiting the Canopy Market. It's definitely a good time for all. Up next, the number four is the Brixton Market. Located in Southern London, the Brixton Market is definitely an awesome market experience. What was once a rougher area of London, Brixton is now a vibrant community featuring a diverse population and buzzing market. The market began in the late 1800s and then grew to include multiple nearby markets and arcades. No, not the ones you play video games in. The ones that are covered walkways with shops lining the sides. Included in the Brixton Market is the Electric Avenue, which was one of the first streets to be lit by electricity. One unique aspect of the Brixton Market is the Caribbean Flair. This is due to the high population of residents that immigrated to this area post-World War II. If you're a fan of Caribbean style food, this area will definitely not disappoint. There are also many vendors that offer exotic fresh fruits and vegetables that you won't be able to find in any supermarkets. Along with produce, there are also many butchers and fishmongers offering some fresh cuts. Brixton Market is definitely worth a visit to view a vibrant location that expresses the diverse population of London. Rounding out our list is Spitalfields Market. This market is commonly known for its artistic nature with a lot of handcrafted products. It also features restaurants, fashion stores, and quirky boutiques. From its small beginnings in the 17th century, Spitalfields Market blossomed. Traders work from a collection of sheds and stalls to meet the needs of London's growing population. Their success made Spitalfield Markets a major center for the sale of fresh produce, trading six days a week. Spitalfields is a fascinating and fun place to visit. It also offers incredible food trucks serving up some of the most amazing street food in London. So much so, you could eat here every day for a month and always try something new. As one of the best food markets in London, Spitalfield Market is the best place to get addicted to new tastes and gourmet cuisines. Whether it's a gift, a new outfit, beauty and grooming essentials, or even an eye test, Spitalfields has it all covered. With something for everyone, this is a must-see market experience. Well, there you have it folks. That wraps up our top five markets to explore in London. These are definitely some great locations with even better food and drinks. What do you think? Were there any locations we missed that you'd include in your list? If so, leave your thoughts in the comments below. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks again, and we'll see you in the next one.